Hello everyone. This video I'm going to show you a really interesting battle between me and Deve. Uh, so we were just trying out uh, what chances uh, the Armenia have versus uh, Barbarians. We tested versus uh, Nervii. So old sworn built like three old swords and some uh, chaotic orders plus naked uh, <coughs> so naked spears, some uh, lay freemen, some uh, Germanic scouts and uh, a mighty horse. It's really hard for Norway, uh, for uh, sorry, for Armenia to deal with. Uh, so we are uh, trying out uh, versus uh, Arverni because Arverni doesn't have uh, naked spears with uh, cavalry counter tactics. They uh, don't have counter to horse archers in uh, the face of uh, Germanic scout riders. They got uh, yeah light horse, but their melee cavalry not missile, and they got only 15 armor. But they got spear nobles, which I think will be very hard to deal with because they're got uh, 77 melee defense, 65 health. Recovery counter tactics, expert charge defense, but expert charge defense. Uh, I don't really like this ability, it works only versus fox units like uh, fox penetration warriors, the kind of versus fierce wars, maybe versus veteran shields, but versus everything that uh, his a uh, bit of, of armor like uh, old sword or even trash nobles probably won't work because uh, the expert charge defense ability just reflects the charge damage to your own unit or part of it and if the unit has uh, high armor it uh, probably won't take any damage because of the armor so let's see uh, the builds. I got two light horse, three chaotic slingers, uh, three lay freemen, some uh, chosen swordsmen, actually four of them, one old sword, two spear nobles, and uh, four heavy horse. This uh, thing pretty standard competitive build. Some uh, spear nobles for dealing with uh, Persian cavalry or. Uh, Noble Horse Archer's late game, the Chon Swordsman for uh, dealing with the Carsley Axeman, the Old Sword for uh, additional aggressive power versus the Carsley Axeman, because they're just a beast versus Armenia. Armenia can't really deal with Old Sword. Uh, the Heavy Horse, kinda like uh, stopping. Uh, force against the Persian cavalry so I'm baiting some uh, javelins for now I'm going to charge uh, the noble uh, horse archers we try to get uh, uh, free charge on the left freemen but now they're going to lose some men to the heavy horse so, uh, my levy uh, sorry my light horse got uh, four losses but waste the entire javelin volley from the Karsley Axeman, so it's good enough. The no horse archers lost 10 men, and I lost 6 men, which is very good for me. And Davis playing the pretty smartly, as you can see, just kiting around, not giving me any kind of engagement. This everything that uh, he should do because he got five horse archers and he can just use uh, all of their ammo but this is just a waste of ammo at the moment he should fart my spear nobles because they're a huge threat to his cavalry he shouldn't charge uh, he shouldn't uh, shoot at my kill the singers that are uh, useless units anyways versus uh, easter factions but they're a very good bait unit and I uh, purposely uh, went into melee mode with them so it could uh, bait my opponent to think that they don't have any ammo 
but I doubt he'll, uh, you know, he's going to be bad. He Devi is not so stupid. <laughs> so I'm trying to get a uh, engagement desperately. I'm going to charge in uh, to the Eastern Spearmen just to route them from the field fast. The Levi Freeman are dead. And I'm just going to try to hold uh, these guys in uh, in place so I could charge in with the Chon Swordsman. But it's not really working out. And let's see. Uh, he's shooting with the no horse archers at my spear nose, but he should position them uh, kind of like here and here. And just destroy this unit of John Swords because uh, here they have their uh, flank exposed. Same over here. But he killed like 20 guys from the Spear Novo unit. And here I bet him with the Heavy Horse. And now his Persian cavalry is most uh, likely going to die very fast. The chaotic engineers are uh, getting some kills uh, against the Karsi Axemen. 16 dead already. And soon to be 20. Yeah, over 20 kills. These guys are wounded. Mine are only active, so nice for me. The Persian cavalry is dying. He's uh, trying to route my cavalry from the field desperately because if my cavalry is dead he basically won the game so let's see the spear novels are getting read by uh Carl Jackson, which is to be expected plus they're getting shot in the rear from novo horse archers nicely done the no spearmen are trying to get to my heavy horse but i'm going to uh probably charge in the uh, eastern spearmen yeah so let's see, I got a very nice charge into the Cartley Axeman and this uh, unit is probably going to die soon. I saw that uh, I'm not going to get away with uh, this unit of heavy horse so I got a charge. It, the charge bonus is not really high but it's still going to do some damage. I'm uh, cycling with the Oldsworn but the charges are pretty buggy because of the weird formations so it's not really effective he's getting some nice funk uh, charges from the Persian cavalry and I'm going to charge in the, the spear novels to the enemy axemen let's see, still firing with these health screeners into the cartly but I should uh, try to fire at the, the Persian cavalry here and here. And my step uh, novel, uh, sorry, uh, spear novels are dead. Let's see, I still got some light horse in reserve. I have to use them. So I saw that the enemy axemen are out from the field. And I can uh, destroy this uh, Persian cavalry. But he saw that and uh, retreated immediately. Very nice move from Deve. And I'm going to try to uh, destroy this uh, unit of Persian cavalry. And he charged another unit of Persian cavalry. But I got spear novels incoming, and these spear novels will wreck all of these cavalry units. My general charge in against uh, David General, but uh, there is uh, almost full HP currently actually in support, so this is very bad for me. So I managed to destroy this Persian cavalry without my loss um, to my uh, heavy horse, but now he's going to get yet another charge with the Persian cavalry, and uh, my heavy horse are probably dead. Around the last uh, Cartly Axeman in this area, and now I can bring all these units to support my general because my general is uh, dying. But it's still Oldsworn and uh, could uh, 
hold down for ages still get tons of kills my left remain with 27 men uh sorry 20 uh already 30 kills actually we'll get a share on soon which is nice to see this waste of time for uh, the noble horse archers uh, getting too many singers is not really the most important uh thing that uh, he can do with the noble horse archers i'm uh, forming a massive blob here and if he did fire with all horse archers at this blob he would have won so easily but then he's waiting uh, he's wasting time on the chaotic singers so i'm blobbing massively here and my general is about to rout which is not good at all the left hand got 50 kills in a chevron so let's see i fired the journey volley but zero kills is bad for me i saw that uh Devi is firing with three horse archers uh, on my John uh, swordsman, so I decided to uh, just charge them and not stand there and get shot in the back. So killed a lot of horse archers, maybe like 10 or uh, 20. Yeah, only 35 guys remain. Now let's see. The light horse, yeah, the light horse is dead, which is very big mistake for me i should have kept the light horse alive and here i could have just activated the uh, uh, frenzy charge but this is a massive cheat for me it should be banned yeah if i did i would have just activated and he won't uh, be able to uh, disengage from like five KB horse and 10 or 20 uh, light horse because then he would pull through and if pull through is banned and this allowed this is a massive exploit this is a massive game changer so the cart laxman uh, route with 60 men very uh, unlucky for Devi so it's only cavalry for, uh, for uh, Devi and I got a small unit of six men of uh, hip horse. I have no idea why they didn't route. So let's see. The John Swordsman got too few men alive. So I'm going to use them just as bait for uh, enemy heavy shot. Because the only unit that can win the battle for me are these spear nobles which already got a double chevron these spear nobles with uh, cavalry counter tactics can uh, demolish cavalry so fast and they got only horse archers alive in the field and three of them are uh, light archers which are useless versus uh, enemy infantry even late game but these uh, horse archers will be b very big trouble <laughs> this guy's got uh, 300 kills he's going to try to destroy my uh, general but disengaging he is going to lose a lot of men he probably lost more men that, than I did and my general is still alive I even uh, uh, popped second wind on my spear nose they were very tired and exhausted and now they're fresh and Devis, uh, no horse archers are exhausted, which is another uh, big uh, bonus for me and very big uh, disadvantage for Deve. So he's trying to snipe some uh, spear nobles, but he should have flanked a bit and far the rear side and not to the front. Yeah, he's going to get some kills, but won't be really massive. The left freemen are still <laughs> holding strong. And keep in mind that uh, javelins for uh, units that uh, are so cheap as the left freemen are banned. And even without javelins, they got a chevron and, 20 and 91 kills on the Persian cavalry. 
So they're not uh, useless without Jarvis at all. And now it's just a uh, kiting game. Let's see. Going to try to destroy uh, the last units of uh, John Swordsman. But the spear knows are incoming. This little charge of horse archers is not troubling me at all. So I can just ignore them. I'll be surprised if they get a cure or two in melee versus spear nobles. So 47 on noble horse archers left, 20 here, and the rest are just uh, shit units. Not really uh, important to the battle. <coughs> So let's see, these no horse archers with 47 men should pull out. So let's see, the also with a triple Sharon. The lay freeman with 100 kills. Leave Freeman, you can get a double Sharon. Come on, can do it. <laughs> Almost. 116 kills. Uh, to no horse uh, archers are main. So, I should uh, get double Sharon with Leave Freeman. <laughs> get double Sharon with Leave Freeman without precursors on them. This would be really MOG. So let's see, he should charge uh, very soon. Going to try to get some funk uh, charges, but his, uh, his uh, cheap uh, horse archers got wrecked. The left men are going to get uh, recharged by you no know, horse archers, which is going to be very bad for the left men. But no, don't route the Bushem, please. Please, guys, you can do it. Yes, yes. <laughs> route at the same time uh, when they got the double Sharon. Last you done, guys. You're heroes. <laughs> so, the last no horse archer going to die soon. Oh no, he got uh, one more. So he's going to return for more. He had three power share on uh, Spear Novels. This is going to be the end. So let's see. Uh, yeah, the Lev Freeman is 3, 4, and 120 with double share on. This is very funny. <laughs> Let's see, the old swarm, yeah, as expected, the old swarm wrecked. The heavy horse and light horse were kind of countered by Persian cavalry, but also countered Persian cavalry. As you can see, three kills with Persian cavalry is very bad. Uh, the Chon swords did uh, very well, but they were expected to, to do very well. But versus Cartley Axemen. Yeah, one guy uh, got uh, 13 kills, uh, one got uh, 54. So, not really good performance by Carly Axon, but these three units did uh, very well. His general did uh, pretty well for Noble Spearman. I hate this unit. <laughs> it's so useless. Uh, the Horse Archers did uh, very well, especially the Noble ones. But I think for uh, the main problem for Deve was that the Persian cavalry uh, got tracked by uh, these spear noble units and the, of course this level freeman <laughs> and if spear nobles uh, won't get uh, destroyed by uh, Karthli Axman in early game this is going to be a massive trouble for Armenia and it's going to be pretty much unwinnable if uh, he doesn't deal with uh, spear nobles early game and of course with uh, my cavalry, but it's very hard with uh, Armenia versus Cerverni.
and I think I think that uh, Urbani have the advantage as all barbarians have uh, against uh, Easterners no matter what uh, rules are uh, being used barbs will always be strong so thank you for watching guys I hope you enjoyed this uh, very fun battle and see you in the next video